It's early spring, late winter here in Wyoming. There's a foot and a half of snow on the ground outside. As I come into the high tunnel here at the UW Research Station, I've, I'm reminded that there's just never too early in the year to start thinking about weeds. Quite often, what's easiest and best to get rid of weeds is to remove them mechanically. I've got different tools here to think about removing weeds today. Um, but what's most important to think about when mechanically removing weeds is to be able to identify the weed. The weed is defined as a plant that's simply out of place. A lot of weeds, like this dandelion, has a taproot that'll go down and if we remove enough of that taproot, we'll destroy the roots. Think about weeds early and often. When a weed's small and has a really hair, small hair-like root, we can disturb the top quarter inch, half inch of soil, breaking those roots with a hoe and uh, we'll be able to control the weeds that way. We have some other plants that will remove really easily by hand. Removing weeds mechanically can save us from having to mix spray and take care of things chemically and quite often it's the only option we have around some of our flower beds and gardening beds. But remember, early and often is best. A weed-free garden is a happy garden. This is Hudson Hill, University of Wyoming Extension. You're watching from the ground up.